Hi, my name is Gary Eastwood. I work at EA Technology as a senior consultant. We've made this film because of some important developments you need to know about concerning SF6 or sulfur hexafluoride. SF6 is a simple molecule consisting of one sulfur atom tightly bonded together with six fluoride atoms with an amazing range of properties that make it the ideal insulating gas for a wide range of high voltage switchgear which is commonly in service around the world. Other benefits are that SF6 is an excellent arc suppressant. In its pure state under normal conditions, it's effectively inert, it doesn't corrode switchgear components, and it is non-toxic to human health. So it's the perfect insulating gas, except for one thing. SF6 has the highest global warming potential of any fluorinated greenhouse gas ever tested. In fact, its effect on global warming is at least 22,000 times that of the equivalent amount of carbon dioxide. Put simply, releasing one kilogram of SF6 gas into the atmosphere has the same impact as 22 tonnes of carbon dioxide. As part of the worldwide electrical power industry, we use approximately 6,000 tonnes of this gas a year. So, not surprisingly, the European Union has issued new regulations to reduce fluorinated greenhouse gas emissions, including SF6. These have been adopted by all member states, including the UK. They set out strict rules for everyone who handles the gas or who owns equipment containing the gas. And there are also special requirements for high voltage switchgear. Obviously we need to comply because it's the right thing to do for the environment and to uphold the good reputation of our industry. We all want to continue using SF6 because of its significant performance and safety benefits when used properly. And finally, member states can impose fines on anyone who doesn't comply. First, anyone who recovers SS6 from high voltage switch gear must hold a valid certificate of competency. This applies to owners of high voltage switch gear and contractors who carry out such operations. Second, certificates of competence can only be issued to persons who have attended an approved training course and passed an assessment set by a specially designated evaluation and competency body. But there is a sting. The regulations require that anyone who currently recovers SF6 from high voltage switch gear must enroll on an approved training course by the 3rd of July 2009. The good news is that EA Technology is running a fully compliant set of SF6 training courses and assessments specifically designed to meet the new regulations and recognised in all EU member states. EA Technology has now been designated as one of the evaluation and certification bodies for the UK by the government department DEFRA. Graduates of our two-day SF6 course emerge fully trained and assessed in the requirements of the regulations with a photo ID competency card valid for four years, a competency certificate and a complete set of course notes and materials on a memory stick. We train using a range of gas handling and testing equipment for maintaining and decommissioning SF6 switchgear. The principles we teach are generic and can be applied to your specific equipment so graduates can carry out the complete range of SF6 handling jobs including safe working on open SF6 compartments using the correct personal protective equipment. Every course is limited to 16 delegates split into groups of eight, so tuition is on a personal level to ensure skills are fully understood and assessed. So which SS6 course is the best option for you and your people? The two-day course is obviously essential for anyone who needs to gain a certificate of competency because it includes an assessment on the second day. Our one-day courses don't lead to certification but are an excellent choice for supervisors and managers who are responsible for developing and upholding SF6 policies and practices, as well as ensuring that contractors are compliant. Our one-day courses are also recommended as refreshers for anyone who has knowledge of SF6 but who needs to get up to speed with the latest developments. So that's all you need to know about the regulations concerning SF6 gas handling and how to comply with them. We can give you a full update on the regulations, a choice of training courses, personal tuition and assessment, a certificate